Hey all, welcome to Spaceships Workshop. The fourth location of the Kane quest line. So the servitor is in pieces. So we are going to seek the help of Rusty to get him together. We got the body separate and the head separate. We need to assemble them. Let's see, we surely have some puzzles here as those uh, alphabets and numbers indicate. This is some math. 9 minus 5 is 4, but what is 4? Let's see. G13 A9. Does that make any sense? We have two colors for 4. G and A. How do I distinguish between the two? Does Rusty have any hint? Okay, here's the end. G13 safety protocol code. So we have to follow the ones in G13 in which number 4 is orange. So 4 divided by 2 is 2 and 9 divided by uh, 9 minus 4 is 5. So 2 and 5 is purple and green respectively. Purple and green. Okay, that doesn't work. 9 minus 5 is 4, 4 is orange in G13. 4 divided by 2, 2 is pink. And 9 minus 4 is 5. I got that right. I don't know what exactly went wrong. I got it. This is 11 and not 9. 9 is the lower one. So 11 minus 5 would be 6 and 6 is blue in color. Those Roman numbers they can be confusing. Uh, where do I put this now? Just put it there for the time being. Uh, I will have to get that out as well because I can't leave it there which means dragging it all the way down okay that is a lot more work than I actually expected so putting the pink and green back in place now that works so let's move on to the next set, maybe more puzzles because we have not touched the A9 yet. This time we have A9 protocol. So we have 3 into 2 is 6, 1 plus 2 is 3. 5 minus 4 is 1. So 6, 3 and 1. 6, 3, 1 in A9 is purple, yellow and blue. So let's do it right this time. Hopefully. This is more like orange than yellow. And that works. So going further into the spaceship.
We have an exit. there probably ready with the machine place the components on the table and find three batteries quantum outburst fill this with crystals so I'm guessing we are having some mirror puzzles with those crystals that we can break with the light of the same color these levers are going to open those gates left here okay let's go get those batteries Like expected, we have some mirror crystal puzzles. process is going to be easy but what is the challenging thing is the others mm, I don't necessarily need to clear off the blue crystals on the left side I will need to clear up the other right side ones maybe I'll just clear up this lane as well I'm going to clear up all the lanes one by one. Removing this blue crystal is important too because that's uh, that's the puppy uh, path. We are going to follow for the green one. So let's change the color to green. That went all the way to the end. And it looks like we are going to need to change the color to blue once again. Hmm, no big deal. removed from here and are several others that I will just go ahead and remove one is left in the center which I'm not sure if I even need but what I currently need is the green right so let's go ahead and change it back to green so that we can have access to the red one That 
that finally gives us the access to the red color well only from one side I will need to use the other mirror to get rid of the other green crystal okay now we can finally change the color to red should not be enough we will need more mirrors inside so we can't be using so many mirrors outside we have at least one extra mirror which is not going to be sufficient but let's just work with it this one um, even if we take it from the left side I will need one two three four five mirrors to take the light inside so that is exactly what we are using right now so i don't think anything changes there we have another mirror inside that we can possibly use let's see what the button does okay we have to press four switch button it seems He is going to get rid of some crystals but that is not going to be enough we have to do something else so that something else is accessing the red light from a different source and I have a plan for that so let's do it this way so now the color gets changed here itself you can take this all the way down here we can even, even go to the other side with this but I don't think we will need to anymore two buttons pressed third one is here and now let's just take the mirror right to the center here which gives us access to the last button you don't need to break all the crystals that is completely optional you can directly hit the battery and go back that's exactly what I'm going to do why should we waste time if we don't have to break those crystals so one battery is done, we should have three levers here, the third one is down here, that opens the third gate, so let's just go into the second one first, there's no specific fault, you can choose to enter any of the gates anytime, each of them will have one battery each, this is okay just as complex i was going to say relatively easy because all i saw was green but that's not the case it is big in size
the left because that is green too. On this section we can change the color to red. There is a green that I need to press first which is possible if we do it from here. Mm, do we need any more greens? We probably do. I'm going to break off these crystals first. Now let's change it to red. Oh and don't forget to press these buttons on the way. There will be four of them again to get that battery. Hmm, looks like I will need some green again and then back to red. Second button is done. I forgot the button down there, but I'll just do it later. Okay, we have enough room for the red light to go through. Let's take it all over. We can directly use the green to convert it to blue. We don't need to go through this red cycle. So I'm going to put this down and rotate this. Alright, we have reversed the cycle. And we can now take these mirrors. One mirror is surely not going to be sufficient, so let's bring in another one. Um, I don't see why it should not be sufficient. I can access all the, side, uh, all the tiles as well as the button with just one. So I definitely don't need the second mirror. There's a helmet part, helmet section there. Um, I'll just probably do it in the end. It's not that far from the source. So I'm going to go in sequence so that it's better for you, the viewers. That's the second battery. Let's go back and find the third one. In the upper section. Some god children to help. I am full of energy, I can do at least another level. So I exactly don't need the god child. But let's keep them. We can use them later. Let's 
see the helmet section should not be that big because we don't have much tiles left and we also have a significant amount of tiles here okay this is the only side that is accessible There's not much work for mirrors here. I think one of the easiest sides. I have to wait for those crystals to break before proceeding further. take a turn or go all the way up but turn is the way to go because we have a button there after pressing that button we of course have to go straight again but let's just press that button first I will have to change it again and again because I chose to bring that mirror on this lane ideally I should have kept it on the other lane and pulled it inside so first out of the four buttons let's continue the color of light has changed In. I will have to take it to the outer lane and do similar to what I did with the blue one because we have a mirror right here so that makes it impossible to pull it in. Now I could pull it in but there's no point in. Okay one more. Second button done. Oh, we have only three buttons here. Let's move this back out. of the buttons is on the left there after that you can simply go back all the way or continue to dig straight there we go the third and the last button the gates have opened up we have to access them from the lower side you can either go back or go this way Going back will save you energy as well as time in this case. So I need to pull this mirror back. Wow, we've got three sapphires here. Oh, that's 
kind of a big bonus I would say. All right, all three batteries obtained. Let's go back and put those and assemble the servitor finally. One of them is the head, other is the body. And the three batteries down here. And we are all set to go. There we go. The servitor has been assembled successfully. Circuits are functioning. And the quest is complete. Okay. Well, now we need to find the other part of Keen. That's for the next location. For now, all we have left is the helmet part, which is here. So let's go ahead and get that. All of those 12,500 tiles, each of them is seeming to give some mint. So that is kind of nice, kind of mix up the cost. Uh, the amount, I think 3 mint each. That's right, 3 mint each. This one gave 4. So the amount is kind of random it seems. 4 mints would otherwise take 3000 energy to dig in the repeatable plus some of the other tiles so these tiles are not that I mean costly because they pay back some of the cost we are going straight the light is just clearing up the crystals as we progress the tiles are not too many, but the cost is what matters. We've changed the color again. And almost at the end. reward sections which actually is a shortcut to go back so that is the first of Kane's helmets three of them and you will have that great equipment from the shop some free resources and we're still not done we have missed one tile somewhere the last tile finder is ready for you so we can use it right away as required. I'm going to have a quick look outside if there is something I can find. Otherwise, I'm just going to use it. Nope, I don't see something that I can possibly open. I kind of thought that one of the jars must be the one that is missing. So this left section, that was the one that we checked out first. Something is missing in there. Oh, this chest. Alright, now we are done. So thank you for watching and see you in the next location.